Our latest project is Miranda Lambert's Airstream. So we've got the trailer gutted, so today we're actually trying to pull some pieces and find some stuff to go into the trailer to really do the build out. Miranda's new tour is called Living Like Hippies. So we've got a lot of inspiration, but really what we need to do now is pull a few pieces that help us put that together. We're here at Bill Moore Antiques in Round Top, Texas. As you can see, there is tons of stuff here. So let's go junkin'. Do it touching stuff. Oh. That's what you need. Amy, I'm on the wrong side to be doing the confessing, but I actually do have a confession. Okay, what is it? The other day, when we were making that mirror, I didn't measure twice and cut once. <laughs> I only measured once. Uh, as long as I don't tell your father, you're forgiven. Okay, okay, so I'm good? I think you're good on okay. that. Okay, Yeah. It's been bothering me so much. That's pretty in there. Ooh, cute. I wish there was something they could store in these if this would work. Guitar picks. It's a lot of guitar picks. It's a lot of guitar picks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at these, Joey. I love those. If she wants more seating, if we could figure out a way to work in something like a pew, you know, that's mm -hmm. also kind of got that religious feel to it. Yeah, I love the idea of it's a like pew. Roadside salvation. The church of country music. Right. Oh, here's a pew right here. It's not like it's right not doing a lot for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Storage. You have to cut out half of that for the wheel well, mm -hmm. though. It definitely worked, but God, I'm just kind of... The color is very committal. It's not I the know. right color. These are way Oh, tiny. these are adorable. But they are tiny. Oh my gosh, Amy, here's a pretty one. Oh, this one might you be think, perfect. Do you think there's any way it would work? Did you see the detail over here? I mean, you know, Yeah, in here, it's almost like we could do storage here. Oh my gosh, it's seating and storage. Mm -hmm. And I don't hate the color. I'm in love with it. Yeah, I think we get should it. get this one for sure. I think we should definitely get it. I think she'll love it. And let's get it back and get it in the Airstream and see if it'll work. Make sure it'll fit. Yeah. Okay. If not, we'll sell Sounds it in the store. I'm getting you this for Christmas, so don't look at it. It was turquoise in here. It was metallic turquoise, but we really wanted to lighten it up and give it a whole different look. So we did a pearl, glitter, metallic cream color in here. Amy, I think this might work great. I know, I think I it mean, might also. I'm kind of in love with it. I think what we should do is hit it lightly with the sander first, and then we might even want to stencil something on here. Oh yeah, that's true. We could have three words there. Uh-huh. Like, Jolie is awesome. <laughs> I mean, it adds three seats, plus a little bit of storage, plus a really cool vibe. Mm -hmm. It's a little roadside redemption. Well, let's pull it out okay. and, and clean it and sand it, and then go from there. Okay. So the first thing we did was have Dad and Adrian pull the pew out of the Airstream so we could get to work on it. And the next thing they're going to do is look at the top of this thing and see where we can cut in some doors so we can have some access panels so we can have some added storage in the back of the pew. Time to pop them. The next step is we have to cut out part of the bracing from underneath the pew to make it where it will fit over the wheel well in the trailer. Wow. What do you is, think? This is oh awesome. Oh my gosh. This is just brilliant. Yeah. This Did is like you expect any less? All of her like cans for the bar. I mean, this is where they can store a everything. This is significant amount of storage also. It really is. When was the last time you turned a pew mm -hmm. into a liquor holding cabinet? Uh, you know, I do things like, I used to do that for a living. So we got to put handles on here of some sort. Yes. Right? right. Because you can't really get it open. No, you can't get a hold of it. Yeah. And, and these have to be sanded. Like cut the vintage yeah. belt. Oh my gosh. I just remembered my vintage belt that I wear all the time actually is, says Wanda on the back. Does it really? Yes. It'd be perfect. You have to because it'd be perfect I think for Miranda this. would flip out for that. We commissioned our friends to build a booth for the nose of the Airstream. Miranda really wanted more seating and hangout space, so a booth is the perfect answer. We picked out this really bold snakeskin vinyl to make it a real focal point. It was a very big decision, but it actually might end up becoming the hero of the Airstream. But never fear, <laughs> no snakes were harmed in the making of this booth. I love this. The table is a whole lot of salvage. We use an old grand piano leg for the base of it. 
And the top is a piece off of an old carousel. And it's actually numbered on the back, it's so old. And then to fill in the space in the middle, we use salvaged wood from a church here in Round Top. So it has a lot of soul, a lot of character, and it obviously serves a really big purpose. Okay! <laughs> I swear that's what we did the first time. Oh, that's great. So we kind of went all out with the light fixtures because in an Airstream you don't have a lot you can do. There's not a lot of wall space, so you really have to be creative with what you have. We did tambourines, uh, like a scrap metal. Ms. Bojangles, <laughs> a scrap metal, um, gypsy style chandelier. So we've made so much progress on the Airstream. It looks like an entirely different Airstream and we're so excited about it. Now it's down to the details, the last minute things we have to do before it hits the road. I think she's going to love it though. I do too. I cannot wait to see. Until I honestly think that this is going to be the reason why she wins a Grammy next year. I do too. I'm glad we're so humble about it. It's important to stay grounded. Yeah, it is. Hey! hey I'm so excited to see you. I'm so glad to see y'all. I literally didn't know what to expect, but I knew it was going to be awesome because it's y'all.